plainly. I think Americans have been on the way to feeling this way for quite a while, especially if you look at the poll numbers as to how many people in America think that China is you know, a real adversary and that Russia obviously is. They both are, and for different reasons, uh, and some of the same reasons. You know, mm -hmm. they're both allied together. Vladimir Putin and Xi Jinping have met 38 times. Uh, the Chinese are mounting massive espionage operations against us, stealing our intellectual property and uh, militarizing the South China Sea. Taiwan and Ukraine, those are on the—they're the geopolitical fault lines right now in this century's ideological struggle between democracy and totalitarianism. But we're finding it challenging. You know, our, our supplies of javelins and stingers, how it's the very things that Taiwan needs, uh, our supply chains are challenged because we're feeding so much to, to Ukraine to fight Russia. And so this administration is going to have to come up with a plan uh, mm -hmm. for how we're going to supply Taiwan with the military assistance that they need. And, and, and that's going to be a critical issue, I think, going forward. No shortage of problems in the world.